a battlefield poem by Lieutenant Colonel John McRae, May 1915. In Flanders fields the poppies blow, between the crosses row on row, that mark our place. And in the sky the larks still bravely singing fly, scarce heard among the guns below. We are the dead. Short days ago we lived, felt dawn, saw sunsets glow, loved and were loved, and now we lie in Flanders fields. Take up our quarrel with a foe, to you from failing hands we throw the torch. Be yours to hold it high. If you break faith with us who die, we shall not sleep, though poppies grow in Flanders fields. Captain Daniel K. Inouye, United States Army, Medal of Honor, Bronze Star, Purple Heart, will now rest here at the National Cemetery of the Pacific in his own Flanders fields, where he rejoins many of his brothers of the Go for Broke 442nd Regimental Combat Team, one of the most decorated units in U.S. military history. Although he was a small in physical stature and maimed by the horrific realities of war, he was in every way a giant. His conviction, his humility, his courage, his honor, and his selfless dedication allowed him to lead and inspire his soldiers to victory on distant shores many years ago. And these same qualities and values enabled him in his truly historic life. We have lost an irreplaceable American, a model of service to country and its values he so treasured. On behalf of the men and the women of the United States Armed Forces, we promise to lead our military and our nation with vigor and character and the grace of Daniel K. Inouye. Captain, Senator, you can rest in peace in your Flanders fields. We have the torch. <laughs>